Hey there, it's Dr. Drea. This is the 33rd episode of Dr. Drea, Cyber Gal for Jesus, Words of Encouragement or Woe. The objective of this 33rd video is to continue sharing some of the lessons I've been learning during my present promised land using the biblical book of Joshua as a key navigational aid as I experience the manifested promises of God in this season of my life's journey. So, to build upon Woe episode 32, this woe focuses on the second chapter of Joshua, verses 12 through 24, specifically verse 15, which states, Then she let them down by a rope through the window, since she lived in a house that was built into the wall of the city. As I continue to navigate my present promised land, I want to circle back on a point I made in Woe episode 31, pertaining to God sometimes using an unlikely ally to assist his people. Shout out to Herbert Lockyer's All the Women in the Bible, who has offered rich contextual analysis regarding Rahab, who is referenced in Joshua 2, verses 1 and 3, Joshua chapter 6, verses 17 through 25, Matthew 1, 5, Hebrews 11, 31, and James 2, 25. Perhaps the most profound and well-known insight about Rahab is that despite her background, she became an ancestress of our Lord Jesus Christ. So the key point of this Navigating the Promised Land lesson is that God's promises oftentimes include a person or persons that we may not readily expect, but who is and are still part of God's master plan that ultimately brings glory to Him and good to us. Until next time, it's Dr. Drea encouraging us to continue to reflect Jesus even in these cyber streets.